Holy moly! So this is what Lady Lake is like. I can't believe it! Oh, so this is how humans live. Don't they find it overwhelming? Wow. Gosh, you'd think so. Just remember, this isn't a sightseeing trip. The real question is, do we try to find Alicia first or look for the Fox Man? So, let's have a look around town for now. Good call. Let's gather information. Hey, son, how about these duds? Made from real silk. My old lady will swap me for it, but they're yours for just 860 gall. Oh, is that cheap? Saray, behind him. Uh, should we give it what for? And have everyone think you're attacking the street vendor? You want to tour the inside of a human jail cell? To everyone else, he looks just like an ordinary human. Oh, yeah. Sure is lively around here. So many people. Don't let your guard down. A crowd just means more Hellions lurking about, drawn to people's corrupted hearts. Look at the size of that thing. Water wheels. They're for grinding wheat with water power, right? Grinding wheat, threshing grain, making yarn. A whole bunch of uses, really. With so many humans living here, they probably rely heavily on larger scale machines like this. Oh, I wonder when this dates from. The foundation looks pretty old, but the wheel itself looks new enough. Zeray. Yeah? This water has been affected by malevolence. What? It flows throughout the town before it gets here. So it seems what Gramps told us is true. It's humans who are creating the malevolence. Understand now, child? No matter how tough things get, stealing is stealing. Shut up, old man. You smell like farts. Huh? What the hell you want now? Whoa. What, you got a problem? Oh, hey, mister. You smell like you'd be mighty tasty. Hey, let's get out of here. And stay down! Can't even swing a fist right! That's different. Indeed. We best not get involved. Dog.
He's here. No mistake, that's the Fox Man. After him! So Alicia really is the Fox Man's target. Looks like it. He probably retreated for now because of the commotion. thought that he would be this fast. The dog's still chasing him. We can't let him get away. <sighs> it's safe. Looks like he cornered it. Are you ready? Of course. Your chicken hunting days are over, Fox. So, you're really that eager to die, are you? Stronger than I remember. When we fought him back in Elysia, he must have been weakened by Gramps' blessing. I'll burn you to cinders! Take that! <laughs> Miklio! <laughs> oh, I'm going to enjoy this. A fitting end for worms who dare to wriggle at a god! I swear, I wasn't... Quiet. Who... Who are you? We won't warn you again. Be silent. Have you forgotten our code, Lunar? You're all out of second chances. Understood? Go. The assassination order was a mistake. Princess Alicia will no longer be our target. You expect me to believe that? We have our honor. Stay. The princess's enemies are legion. For those who wish to remove her, assassination is but one option among many. You have bigger worries than who we are or what we do. I suggest you hurry to the pedestal where the sacred blade is kept. Why are you telling me this? Honor. So? I guess I should be thanking you for saving us. <laughs> hey, are you alright? What? What in the world? Looks like we were saved by an assassin's guild. By a what? They were after Alicia by mistake or something. They took that fox guy away with them. But more than that, 
It looks like Alicia's not out of danger yet. Looks like? What's going on? Hey, I don't get it any more than you do. Let's just hurry to that pedestal. We can't go any further. There's gotta be some way. What's that? Whoa! No one told me the sanctuary would be this gorgeous. You can tell the shepherd myth is a big part of the culture here. Strange, though. There's no sense of blessing at all. Now that you mention it, we could always feel Gramps' blessing back in Elysia. Granted, Gramps is a particularly powerful seraph. But even so, this town has a high concentration of malevolence. It's honestly making me a little sick. You gonna be okay? For now, at least. I'm starting to think it'd be a bad idea to stay too long, though. This place has even more Hellions than we imagined. They're wandering around right there in front of us, and yet we can't do a thing. I'm as frustrated as you are. But our hands are tied. We don't have the power of purification. Besides, there's a reason for the Hellion manifestations. They're feeding on the evil in people's hearts. And in such a pretty town. Probably part and parcel of life in human cities. Is that a monolith? No entry. If you want to check out the festival, go out front. What gives? You're letting him through. Well, that's because I'm festival staff. That's right. Authorized personnel only. Everyone else, move along. But it's urgent. Can't you do anything? Afraid not. Do you need a hand? You look like you're in a bind. I bet you want to get at that pedestal now, don't you? Yes. Alicia could be... They don't need to know that. I mean, if you could help me out, it'd really make my day. Sure thing, but we'll need some cash. Cash? Yep. Remember the guard back there? He's not averse to a little grease on his palm, if you know what I mean. We can get you through. How much? Let's see... I think 1,000 gold ought to cover it. Hope you're okay with this, Gramps. Whoa! This is one swanky-ass pipe! This is easily worth over a thousand gold. You should probably get it appraised first. Forget it. I just need your help right now. Well, all right. Works for me. I know you're in a hurry. Let's go. Well, shall we? Yeah. This is the guy. You good? All right, then. I'll be taking your sword. Let's have it.
Well, that was easy. By the way, that pipe you gave me is worth way more than a thousand gold, no question. Be sure to come and see me again when you're done. I want to give you a fair deal. I appreciate it. Well then, we gotta get back to work. Thanks so much! Huh. Hmm. We went through all that trouble, and we can't see the pedestal. Is that what you're thinking? <laughs> well, sorta. Hey! What are you doing? <laughs> Being invisible has its benefits. Seriously? Hey, Saray, come over here! What is it? Saray? Alicia! Is that you, Saray? Welcome! And who may this be? This is Saray. Ah, yes. The one who rescued our princess way out there in the ruins. Saray, this is Lady Maltran. She's been appointed as the committee leader for the festival this year. She is also the one who taught me the way of the spear. Nice to meet you. I'm Saray. It is a pleasure. By any chance, did you come here to attempt the trial of the blade? Not just that. To tell you the truth. What this mysterious organization has told you is true. There are indeed those who think less than favorably of me. But even so, I cannot live my life in fear of them. But... but Alicia... Thank you so much, Saray. I really appreciate your concern. Soon, the finale of the festival, the Flames of Purification, will begin. Please enjoy yourselves. So this is what states people deal with. She didn't even flinch. Oh, that's right. Check out the pedestal. Oh, right. If no one else can see her, does that mean she's a Seraph? You probably can't remove the sword unless you can speak with her, meaning no ordinary person can do it. Incredible! So that means the legends were true! Hey, say something to her. Me? Unless you want me looking like a total weirdo. But still, 